you're probably noticing that my audio isn't syncing up. Ah, the joys of being a YouTuber. Anyway, that's life. I'm going to tell you what's going on. I'm here at Koshan555, and I'm participating in the SOM Smackdown. I'm competing against four other Bay Area SOMs to see who brought the best wine to pair with the dish. I am pretty competitive, so I'm fingers crossed that I win this thing. But first, I'm going to take you around and show you what this whole thing's about. I've got my cheerleader here with me too, Jerusha. Hi guys! Yep, sound's still out. Jilly's here too. We're going to be going around. They're going to be helping me to win this thing. And yep, Jerusha's saying some smackdown. Very exciting. Anyway, let's uh, let's all check this out together. But you can never walk alone on your way to being free. Where are you? Jilly's here, not coping with the heat. Yeah, we have to in from a press restaurant right here in Napa Valley. Chef told us he was going local with all the ingredients, so uh, as a sommelier with an all Napa Valley wine list, I felt compelled to do exactly the same, so I went local today. But of course, doing my research on Chef, I knew the ingredients he gave us were going to be tweaked a little bit here and there, so I was ready for a little bit of a challenge. So I went to another guy who was also ready for a challenge, Matthew Rorick from Forlorn Hope. And as a friend just told me, so Matthew is somebody that champions esoteric varietals and usual vineyards. He doesn't do cab, he doesn't do Chardonnay, he does everything but. And he loves that, and we love that about him. And what else he loves is doing exactly what the grape wanted. He doesn't use a lot of oak, he doesn't use anything artificial. He is somebody that loves the grapes and is a viticulturist first and foremost. So I did a, a 2012 Semillon from right here in Yountville from the Yount Mill Vineyard. This is 100% Semillon made in a very old world style so it's really nice and bright and crisp mineral driven. I saw seaweed, I saw trout roe and I went well that's gonna be pretty salty I'm pretty sure so we better play up those elements. So that's what direction I went with. I went with a really nice bright crispy mineral driven seaweed-esque wine with a little bit of structure a little bit of weight to balance out that uh, San Francisco sourdough. So that's we're recording today and I hope you guys enjoy. Now that the wine portion of the van is out of the way, we're walking around, we're gonna get some food. That guy was doing some crazy butchering back there. There's so much insane stuff that these chefs are doing. It's unbelievable, but there's a ton of people here. It is 108 degrees right now. It is so freaking hot. But we're managing, we're keeping cool, we're drinking water, drinking wine, and uh, trying to stay a little bit shaded. I don't know how I'm gonna eat it, but mine's great. Would you like a Coltel? Yes. Yeah. Like, that's a question. Oh my god, thank you. Ice cold for you. That's awesome, thank you. You're welcome. Oh, you have dude. the towel? I, I have a cold towel. towel. I'm just gonna live like, I saw you like hold this for a while and Wait. cool off. Do you have that? That guy's awesome. Yes. Oh, Woo! Nice. Feels yeah. so good. It's <laughs> a good pickup for you. What is that? Pork belly taco, chicharrones, and a little bit of cilantro. Mmm. Oh my god. That's so good. I don't know how these chefs are doing it. It is, it is literally 108 degrees out here. They're standing by live fires. They've been here for hours roasting these pigs, trying to get food out for us. It's really an amazing job. Five amazing songs, picking one bottle that would go with a dish from 
our good friend Robin Song for the forthcoming Gibson restaurant in San Francisco. All right, guys. Right, so I'm back down, down Earth Fire, 2017, beautiful Charles Crew, Winery. Robin Song. <laughs> it was really fun. I didn't win, which always sucks, but what are you gonna do? Uh, that was a blast. Now I gotta go to work, and uh, I, gotta, I gotta do what I just competed to do for real. I gotta go some on the floor of press. Guys, that was so much fun. I hope you had a blast hanging out with me today. Congrats to Ashley on the win. Um, her reasoning was delicious, truly. It was a wonderful pairing. Um, I'll see you guys later.